In this video, we are going to have the joy of watching How to Succeed in Business with Michael Scott, a clip from The Office. Yeah. I'm Liz J. Simpson, founder of The Big Money Movement, accompanied by Heather Patrick, one of our esteemed coaches. She's just magical. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Heather, let's have a little fun and yeah, see what's yeah, happening. Yeah, yeah, baby. All right, here we go. The fundamentals of business. Ooh. The fundamentals Mental. of business. Mental is a part of the word. I have underlined it. Because you're mental, if you don't have a good time, you have to enjoy it. Well, the, the fun is in it. <laughs> Oh, oh, fine. Yeah. Oh, right. Get out. Oh my gosh. Yes. That's so me. There's it no all fun. starts with, with a hand. handshake, but you handshake. can't just go right to the selling. You need small talk. Oh, oh, talk. Oh, talk. I Can you oh you're out. Small yeah. talk. Golf, mm -hmm. stock market, mm -hmm. Dave Matthews. Yes, what else? Uh, small things, peas, ball bearings, weather. dimes. No. Where do oh, you yeah. live and how's yeah, the weather where you good? are? Come on yeah. out. Meredith, come up here. Let's do a little something. So Meredith this and I great. have okay. just started conversing, and I will say, so Meredith, how was your weekend? What did you do? Well, I caught my son taking a dump on the upper part of the okay. toilet. Oh, right. Right. Okay, okay. okay. God. No, Maybe that's real life, because there are some real overshares. And do it. What? Write a book. What? The Fundamentals of Business by Michael Scott. <laughs> Over one billion sold. Oh. oh, goal setting. More than the Bible. I'm not surprised. Oh, Chapter know. one. Handshakes, that's what you think. The businessman. Daryl. Oh, I would like to give you the only copy of Somehow I Manage. Unfinished. Oh, wow. Oh, if there's anybody here who can finish it, it's you. <laughs> that's sweet, Mike. Let's see here. Here's a chapter called Gum, mm. one sentence. Everybody likes the guy who offers them a stick of gum. This is true. I mean, I'm going to choose violence because there's a lot of authors who are selling me empty books. Get my tip book. I'm like, how about you add some more chapters to this? OK, All right. I'm choosing violence. Moving on. But you also have to win to play. What? You have to win to play. Oh, mm. he's trying to be God. deep. Bless and I will give you the the rest of the ten at lunch. So, you want to start a business. How do you start? What do you need? Well, first of all, you need a building. Oh, oh. this is secondly still being taught. You need supply. You need, need debt, something need overhead. to sell. No, now, no, this no, could no, be no. anything. It could be a thingamajig or a. I think I've been to this class in university. <laughs> or. I'll watch him a call. Ah, he's prepared. He's got AIDS. He's got visual AIDS. Listen. In order to have a payday. Oh, oh genius. Clever. And if you sell enough of them, you've got a million. You will make a 100, 100 grand. grand. Uh -huh. oh, we need those. That's what we tell our women. Oh, darn it. Satisfied. Oh, oh. Hey, boss. I didn't know you were coming in today. What's uh, going on here? I am glad that you asked. Listen up, everybody. In the last year, we have lost seven clients <laughs> to the big uh -oh. chains. These gift baskets are our ticket back into their lives. Oh, my God. We're going to this show up at toys. these businesses unannounced, and we are going to win them back. With gift baskets. With, with peanut brittle. Peanut brittle. With Macadamia nut cookies. Well, not with customer with chocolate experience turtles, or value with or raspberry jam and a little bit of fat and salt. Because you know what? That's what people like. Yeah. Ever since I was a kid, people have been telling me that I can't do things. You can't be on the team. You can't move on to second grade. Well, now they're telling me that I can't win back clients using old-fashioned business methods. Mm. Old -fashioned. Let's see about that. And FYI, I eventually ate second grade, and I was the biggest kid in class. Um, yes, I was the first one out, and yes, I've heard women and children first, but we do not employ children. We are not a sweatshop, thankfully, and uh, women are equal in the workplace by law. <laughs> so I let them out first. I have a lawsuit on my hands. 
another rule of business okay. is being able to adapt to different situations. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Adapt, react, readapt, apt. Right? That's rule number two. The most sacred thing I do is care and provide for my workers, my family. I give them money. I give them food. Not directly, but through the money. I heal them. Today, I am in charge of picking a great new health care plan, right? That's what this is all about. Does that make me their doctor? Sure. Um, Do you think so? Yes, <laughs> in a way. Yeah, like a specialist. Whole lot of wrong <laughs> going on. Right? Yeah. It's a train wreck. I can't, I want to look away, but I can't look away. <laughs> oh my gosh. I see pockets of truth. Obviously exaggerated. That's the whole point of a satire is yeah, to exaggerate. Yeah. But man, it is based but on I think some truth. I think that's why it chafes is because it's like, it's almost too true in some places. Yes. Right? Like. <sighs> okay. All right. Listen, okay. We got to dive into this for a second. Um, first and foremost, um, just his need. <laughs> Fundamentals, mentals is in the word, and then re react, adapt, apt. Like uh, this need me. for like I Dr. Seuss, ABC, one, two, three. I do see that a lot. Like, you yes. know, we work with women entrepreneurs, and so we talk a lot about building frameworks. And sometimes yeah, I think stretch. approach to frameworks feels a little bit like one <laughs> fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish. <laughs> like, so I get it, but they're hard to develop. So I do get that. Yeah, um, this is true. Um, <laughs> And, and I love the opening scene around his, like, what was it, the leadership? Oh, yeah. Uh, the, I don't know. Keys to success. And I don't know. Like, he's drawing a blank, about. right? Yeah. Like, how many times have you, like, been mm. like, all right, I'm going to write this resource. Yes. I'm going to create gonna this. going to write the book. And it's going to be awesome. It's going to yes. be, like, the next thing. And yeah. then you just got. Nothing. Oh, my gosh. Writer's block is real. Like, there were, sometimes it was, when I was working on my first book, it was, like, a month where I was, like, can't mm. think what more to say, mm. you know, in the book. So I appreciate that. Okay, what kind of gives me, like, the heebie-jeebies as I watch this show is, like, I'm reminded that, like, we've I think we've all had, okay, I'm talking personally, mm -hmm. you know, where we've had experiences of bosses, and you're, like, in the moment, you're young, you're impressionable, you want mm -hmm. advice and guidance and coaching. You got to be careful who you're listening to. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> or, like, the character who knows this is BS. Yes. Like, oh my gosh, I just saw a meme on uh, social media and it was somebody talking about their exhaustion from fake laughing at work. Oh, oh my gosh, like the leader who <sighs> swears they have brilliance and you have to go along or the person who thinks they're hilarious and you're like, <laughs> okay. Like, or, yeah, or the boss <laughs> that thinks he's God because like, you oh, know, yeah. I'm providing I'm for you. I'm feeding you and I'm, I'm your doctor. You, yeah, and I'm <laughs> your doctor, basically. Yeah, definitely. I think oh. this is a master class on how not to succeed and just do the opposite of what he's doing. <laughs> now, I did love the role play. I mean, he definitely gave that woman a chance to practice. And so, yeah, I good. think that was, that was good. I'll take well. that. Speaking of train wrecks, let's move on to another one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Click the next video and let's pay attention to Wolf of Wall Street and how to pick up the phone and call. Let's see if Leonardo can get this right for us. Mm. We'll see you there. <laughs> Bye.